Hello guys, in this tutorial I will be sharing the steps involved to use the cloud based rendering services from Fox. Before proceeding further, just we can go through about the cloud computing. What is cloud computing? Assume we run a website without using cloud computing technology. We will be having web servers based on the number of users. So if the number of users is getting increased, we need to expand the servers to accommodate the traffic of the incoming users. It is a good sign if the number of users get increased rapidly. Suppose if the scenario changes, like if there is a sudden drop in number of users from 60 to 10, then it will be a bad sign as we will be having more number of servers compared to the number of users. So the number of idle servers will be more and we will be spending money on those servers which is not been used. So it is a loss. So it is not a flexible thing for an organization. With cloud computing, the hosting servers can be flexible according to your requirement. If the number of users are less, you can shrink your hosting servers to minimum. If the number of users are more, you can expand the hosting servers to maximum according to your requirement. And you will be paying for what you will be using. Just like your electricity bill. If you are using more electricity, you will be paying more. If you are using less electricity, you will be billed less. So these are the main advantages of using cloud computing. Back to Fox Render Form. By using the same cloud computing technology, we can gain access to around 2000 render blades virtually by sitting at home. After visiting the website foxrenderform.com, you can sign up for a free trial. After completing the free trial, you can check out your account which will have topped up with $20 as a startup amount which can be used to test out the render form services. Next, you need to download the application which will be used to manage the files to and fro from your PC to Fox, vice versa. Just go to client download and download the application using the download button. After installation, you can log in using your Fox account, provide the username and password and your client application will get loaded. Using this client application you will be virtually accessing the Fox render form. And this is the main window. Click on the file manage icon. And this is a project structure where you can use the folders according to your software requirement. In this example we'll be going with a Maya based project. This is a simple Maya example file which will be rendered using Fox render form. It contained geometry cache and uh, ocean texture. So this is our project folder in our local system. Scene file residing inside the scene folder geometry cache residing inside the data folder and the ocean texture residing under source images folder. Now we need to upload all these data to Fox. Using the application browse inside my project and create a new folder called others. Just follow the same naming convention so that it will be easy to organize files jumping inside the folder you can upload the folders once you select all the required files the files will be getting uploaded to the Fox server and the status can be seen using this tab file transfer tab so once the upload gets finished we'll start setting up the file for render in Fox render form. Now the files has been uploaded and it is ready for rendering. 
just click on Maya button and select the version by which the scene file has been created. Next, select the project directory which is others. Next, select the scene file. Okay, click on next. Just check texture file. This is the cache file. Next, this is the start frame, end frame, render cam, render resolution, and this is the output folder where the rendered images will get transferred. And before submitting it for render, you got two options one is unlimited render, second is the metered render. So we'll be going for metered render. This is pay as you use and if you are sure about the task then you can go for full speed render click on next so now we have initiated an auto download task so this is the status of the rendering so once the files get rendered it will get automatically transferred to this location that is D Fox render form images. This is how we can render our Maya Sun using Fox render form. Next, go to the website, login using your username and password. And this is the same as your application, but this is web based contains the same option here you can find the option called recharge this is where you will recharge your account and make sure you got enough amount in your account as the render bell stops in the middle if you are running out of cash and this is where you can check your balance or invoices um, that's it